Okay, so I've taken a shower, and um, while I was in the shower, I thought of a couple things that I wanted to talk talk about. Well, yeah. Anyway, I it's, it's seven, and I'm already in my pajamas. So if that tells you anything about me, I obviously don't have a life, and I don't do anything. But I made more notes. Yay, notes! And uh, I'm this this video is going to be extremely personal. I'm talking about my crush. And, um... <laughs> and basically how stupid I act around him. Um, I'm not gonna say his name, because that'd just be awkward if he ever watches this. Um, <laughs> but, okay, so, like, I generally, when I like somebody, it's, when I, just, for general people, just in my life, I generally don't like people like, I mean, like, people that I'm closest to, I don't like them when I first meet them. I don't know why this happens, but I generally dislike them when I first meet them. Like, m a lot of my best friends I disliked when I first met them. I was like, what? Like, I was like, I don't like you very much. But then they turn out to be, like, you know, really close to me, and, you know, like, we get along great. And that happens with a lot of my friends, especially one of my friends right now. And so, you know, it happened with, um, my crush, too. Uh, I, you know, I didn't really think much of him, I was just like, you know, he's just, you know, another person, and, um, yeah, and so I didn't like him very much at first, and then, like, I, I feel like I started to get him no, so, so one day it just happened, one day it just happened where I was like, he's really cute, like, how did I miss this before, like, I didn't, I didn't understand, how could I miss, like, how cute this guy was, like, and, um, we have a lot in common, and it really makes me happy, but he makes me so nervous. Like, I've never felt this nervous around anybody before, and he's one, he's one thing that makes me happy, even though he doesn't know it. Like, we really don't know each other at all. Like, it's so awkward, because I, I do the stupidest stuff. And so I was coming back, um, back from my extended fall break, and, um, like, you know, I changed my hair. Like, when I first left, I was blonde and had, like, you know, pink and, like, blue in it. And so, you know, I, I came back and I saw him and I waved. And, um, you know, he, he didn't look very happy. And he just, he didn't respond. He didn't, like, wave back or even really look at me. And I drove by him and I was like, oh, a wave. And then he's just, mm, and I was just like, oh. <laughs> I got really sad and, like, you know, but then I was like, maybe he just didn't recognize me. And... So, you know, I, I went on to unpack all of my stuff, and I was carrying everything to my dorm. And, uh, like, there's guys in this dorm, too. And so, like, I walk up to the front of the building, and I see him sitting in, like, one of the chairs waiting for me. And he's like, oh, hey, you know, like, he doesn't mention not recognizing me or anything. And so, you know, he, un he like, waved his fob over the thing so we could both get in. And, you know, he opened the door, and so I went in. And then, like, there's a second door. And I forgot that it, you pull it, and so I kind of like, I pushed it, and I didn't realize why it wasn't opening, and I just full on ran into it, my face hit the door, like, I was just like, Duh! and I was like, and he started laughing, and it was so embarrassing, like, <laughs> I ran into a door right in front of my crush, like, and I just, I got so nervous. And this one doesn't really count, but while we were in the art room, I, like, I was, I, like, I, like, so the sink, okay, it has, like, little holes punched in it, and I thought my, you know, I was like, oh, I can set my paintbrush, like, through the hole, and, you know, it'll stay there, and so then, like, it'll, like, so I don't have to hold on to it, and it won't get wet again, and, you know, so I, I, I stick my paintbrush in the hole, and it just falls right through, like, they're not very big holes, they're, like, <laughs> tiny and I still somehow it went straight through and he was in there and I told him you know I was like don't laugh at me but I just lost my paintbrush in the sink and he's just like what I was like I went down the hole and I I, I swear I thought it was the most brilliant idea I could come up with and generally those ideas always really suck and so and so another time just the other day this weekend me and my friend were in the lobby, you know, watching, like, just, you know, being weirdos, and 
So, like, I see him, like, we're on the couch, and I see him, like, walk by, and I, I, I go to wave, like, because he's waving. And so I go to wave, and I, like, I, this is what I did. I, like, went up my nose. I just up, and it stung, it hurt, and I, I know he saw it, and it was, he, he was gone by the time that I opened my eyes, though. So I was just, like... <laughs> Why? <laughs> so practically, I picked my nose right in front of him. Accidentally, I, I stabbed myself in the face with my fingers because I got so nervous. Like, I can't, I can't think. Honestly, I, I get so jumbled up inside that I can't think. I can't, I can't, like, function correctly when he's around. It's so embarrassing. And, and it's really frustrating. And so that's what I wanted to talk about. So this is a short video. So... Oh, I forgot to do my intro. Bye! I just had the horrific experience of my phone falling off and then my gargoyle falling off, falling off, falling, 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 falling. Okay, anyway, so I want to hear your crush stories you can leave a video response or a comment down below i want to get more involved so yeah bye do some crazy stuff while you're thinking about crushes have you done anything awkward in front of crushes tell me please i want to know because that hair dryer is driving me nuts i hate it i hate it